What's going on, everybody? It's Inferno here with another video today, and we're going to be continuing on with Pokemon Uranium. Now, in the last episode, uh, okay, this is obviously not the right way to go, but in the last episode, we managed to, hey there, we managed to collect our, get our first starter Pokemon, and I got, I got Rapporch, and you know, I, I, I saw a really good one uh, in the comments. Uh, I might change it to to Festus later, but um, you know, if I could find the Route One, that'd be pretty neato. All right, now where are you? Are you not here? All right, so it has to be right over here, right? Right? Yes, there he is. Hey, Inferno! I want to show you. I want to show you and Theo how to catch Pokemon. Can you go get him? He should be in his house. Oh, great. Now we have to go find Theo's house. Alright. Uh, Theo, where are you? Route 3 ahead. Cool. We need, like, Rock Smash for that. Look, it's Theo. Oh. What did you say to my son? He ran upstairs crying and locked the door behind him. He won't tell me what's wrong or come downstairs. I swear, if you did anything to hurt him. Oh, so that's how it is. So he got the weakest starter and you beat him in battle. Hmm, I see, that explains it. A harsh lesson to be sure, but losing is as much part of being a trainer as winning. He had his heart set on, on this day being perfect, so losing right off the bat is somewhat of a shock. Still, crying won't solve anything. That's something he has to learn. Theo! Come downstairs right now, young man. Theo, you can't cry every time you lose a battle. That's just part of being a trainer. But it isn't fair. Inferno got the better start than me. Now I'm never gonna win. Then you'll have to catch more Pokemon to balance out your team's weaknesses. Besides, a well-raced Pokemon can still win, even at a disadvantage. Oh, well. Really, uh, Theo's just uh, kind of a crybaby. There's no sense in giving up before you even begin. Yes, Dad. Now, Theo, I won't always be around to pick you up when you're feeding down. So try and be strong for yourself, okay? Inferno, please be patient with my son. He looks up to you, you know. Oh, and you're three out Inferno. Theo, I have something for both of you. Like a present? Yes, exactly. Inferno, your father Kellen sent me these and told me to give them both to you when you began your journeys. I'm sure it will come in useful. The Pokepod. What's that? High-tech device, indispensable for Pokemon trainers. It, oh, it plays music and includes a map of the region. It also has a phone, so <clears throat> allows us to communicate. Nice. All right. Uh, let's go. Let's go. Let's go, Theo. All right. Well, talk about a dramatic turnaround. He always does that quickly. All right. Let's let's get going. Uh, okay. He's oh. So he's uh, getting a new job at the construction worker at the power plant at the Lyceum. All right, let's go. Uh, let let let's see here. Uh, all right, let's go right up here. We should find Theo and Professor Bamboo. Hey, Inferno. Now that you and Theo are here. It's time to begin your first lesson as a Pokemon trainer and field research aid. Now, watch closely. Wild Pokemon, as you probably know, inhabit tall grass. But that's not the only place. You can also find them in caves, water, and even in cities if you know where to look. Still, tall grass is going to be your best bet for finding new Pokemon. Simply take a few steps in and... Oh, this is new Pokemon. Chinmunk. Monk. Alright. This little guy. Oh. Oh, it's the other dude. Alright. Uh. Chin. Alright, so basically, you gotta weaken it and throw a Pokemon now. Nice. Grats, bamboo. And that's how it's done. Whoa. Great, it's 6 in the morning and I'm recording a video. 
And that's how it's done. Now, Chen Monk are fairly easy, but you're sure to encounter Pokemon that are a lot harder to capture. For those, you might need to inflict them with status effects or use a special Pokemon. Ah, but I'm sure you'll get a hang before too long. Inferno, see you. These are for you. Oh, we both received the Pokedex. The Pokedex is an encyclopedia that will automatically update itself whenever you encounter or catch new Pokemon. It's very important for my research, so make sure to fill it out as much as possible. Also, I want you to have these. Pokeballs, great. That's kind of... We need those. Pokeballs are necessary for catching Pokemon, of course. What's that thing the kids always say? Gotta catch them all. Gotta catch them all. Gotta catch them all. Hey, gotta catch them all. Gotta catch them all. You can always pick up a few more at the Pokemon. Uh, yeah. Oh. Great, we got, we got a bamboo number into the Pokedex. Alrighty then. And he should be off. There we go. So, see, oh, great. We, all right. So he still wants to be the trainer, even though he has the weaker Pokemon. Look at that. He managed to get through the grass without encountering a single Pokemon. Kind of impressive. All right. Let's see where we are. Route one. Nice. Oh, it's a. It's, it's a thing. Oh, I found a potion. Nice. All right. Oh, ho, ho, it's our first battle of the day. Yeah, yeah. All right. School kid tap would like to battle. Chin monk. Hey, it's the Pokemon we found. The 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 common one. All right, blue. All right, let's see. Fight. Let's 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 go with the girl. Just kill it with fire. Zoink. All right, not bad. It dealt about half damage. Oh, that's good. We're already kind of dying. Now if that thing gets another critical hit. Uh. We, we, we lost. <laughs> Alright, so now that Bamboo gave us our Pokeballs, and, yeah, uh, I kind of got them. He has to start working again, so that's pretty nice! Alright, so... I mean, this is Nuzlocke, so we have to take every chance we get. A Chinyuk. Alright, great. Wow, that's kind of lagging a lot. Alright, what will Blue do? Let's see. We'll fight. And... Uh, it's kind of growth that we don't lose as much HP. <laughs> Alright, Chinyuk's attack fell. And she used Tapple. Oh, ho, 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 ho. Paul, you're so screwed now. On top of that. Awesome. Alright. Let's, let's just try so we don't kill it. Yeah, that's good. Alright, now that thing used to grow on me. And the burn. Alright, let's use one more sky. Should be able to. Knock it down. There we go. Yeah, that's that's good. All right, growl. Great. Blue's attack though. Now, the burn affects it, and we should. No, not Pokemon though. We should be able. Oh, we. Oh, he only gave us five Pokemon. All right. I mean, that's decent. Why go one? We go two. Wiggle three, click. All right, that's great. Chin monk. All right, chin monk zero was added to the Pokemon. Chin monk, the chipmunk Pokemon. The length of a chin monk stripe determines its authority in the group. If it spots predator, if it spots predator, it shrieks loudly to warn the others. Would you like to? Yeah. All right. Uh. Uh. Oh. Hmm. I wonder. 
characters and name changer around here. All right, so Chin Monk. Uh, well, it's a chipmunk, and he's blue. I'm calling Simon. Oh no, that was a bad choice. This one's a girl. Dang it, I didn't even realize that. Great. All right. Well, Route One, nice. Are there any like people? Oh, our counter. Uh, we could already get. Yeah, yeah, we're you need one. Please don't be a chin monk. Please don't be a chin monk. Please don't be a chin monk. Oh, it's a kabug. All right. That's great. All right. What will blue do? Well, that thing looks like a bug type, so we probably shouldn't use ember on it. Great. No, no. Great, my attack harshly fell, which is kind of bad because that's what I need. All right, let's let's eat a Pokemon over there. Wiggle one, wiggle two, wiggle three. Gotcha. All right, Kabogo was hot. It's great. The love bug Pokemon. It shares characteristics with bug and mammal Pokemon, being in pr being in its presence has a calming effect. Not bad. All right, Kabug, cuddle bug. Right, so it's a female. Oof, wow, I'm just I am horrible with things. Cuddle. Cuddle bug. Bug. There we go. All right. Well, when I'm finding when I find a name changer, I'm definitely going to use him a lot. All right. Uh. Well, my Pokemon's kind of a bit hurt from the Chin Monk battle. Uh. So let's go over to. I don't know where where, where would they heal it, Mom? Would would Mother be able to heal it for us? Let's see. Wait a minute. You're not Mother. Oh wait. Hi there. Uh. All right. So he's playing a video game. Uh. No sense talking to him. All right. Let's see here. If we go up here. This is our house. It's always the nicest one. Aha. Uh -huh. Hi, Auntie. Aha. Uh -huh. Taking a break from our adventure and. Uh. Ah, uh, yes. So my mom was, my mom's name was on TV at least. So, let's go here. Great. Now, we already have three Pokemon in our belt, under our belt. Which, I mean, that ain't half bad. Ooh, look, a Pokeball. Fur of Outer Potion. Not bad. Might be useful. Hey there. Hey there. Oh, hey Inferno, I just got a new Pokemon and I want to see what it does. Alright, great. It's a school kid task. Alright, level 5 chin, chin Monk. I'm really going to have to do quite a bit of battling. Alright, so. For starters, let's, let's go with Growl. Alright. Alright, well, we just got tackled. Yes! Flame body, you're amazing, Rap Torch. Great, already getting hurt by the burn. All right, let's go with Ember. Ho ho ho! Nice. Now the great thing about burn is that it doesn't. When a Pokemon is afflicted with the burn condition, not it not only will it take damage every round, but its attacks that will also drop. So that's pretty good. Burby. Okay. Uh, I, th I think we're good. The Burby. Oh. Uh. No. Let's let's go back. Night growl. <laughs> oh, that's great. Greatness. Uh, Al? Wanna say? K. 
Okay, I mean, I, I think it's more of a, what, electric type, right? I pray that I'm right. Oh, I'm torch. All right, we're good. No, what did I, why did I do? It does it, yes, oh, that's great. I thought you was growl. All right. Woo, blue, you're at level seven now. Nice. I'm not as strong as I'd hope. All right, 200 bucks straight from this kid's wallet. All right, perfect. Looks like you're a natural trainer for a wolf. Well, I hope we'll keep that. All right, now, uh, there we go. Ooh, Pokedex. Save game pod. Let's go to our bag. Uh, potion. No, 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 not the rare candy. All right, let's use the potion. We need to use the potion on the blue. Uh oh, we used our last potion. Oh well. All right. Hey, not bad. We found an antidote. Okay, it's a uh, kabug. All right, blue. We we're getting some nice, uh, so nice little starch here for you, Ember. And aha, uh, one hit KO. Great. Perfect. All right, let's. Uh, uh, hello there. Uh, what? Look, people live here. Hey, I'm a fisherman. These plants next to my house have a wide variety of Pokemon. If you prove you're strong, I may give you my old fishing rod. But first, you need to defeat Maria. No, n no touch. City gym leader. My brother's a great fisherman. He loves water Pokemon. That's cool. It's pretty cool. All right. Let's continue on with uh, Route 1. Hey there. It's a nice river, isn't it? Cool. Oh, right on the last patch. Great. Another Chin Monk. Go, Blue. All right. Well, these guys, I'm going to... Chin Monk and, and Cubbugs, I'm going to train off screen. Because that uh, training on screen is kind of... Yeah, kind of boring. All right. Now, you know, I'm not too sure I explained uh, what the Nuzlocke rules are in the previous episode. Nuzlocke rules basically state that you can only catch one Pokemon per round. So, in Route 1, I already used up my catch shoot with Kabug. Thankfully, I didn't find another Chin Monk. Alright. Go down here, there's nothing we need to surf. Hey there. Run! There we go, we're good. Perfect, alright, great. Oh, whoop! I mean... Right on the first patch, great. First and last patch, oh! It's the Burby! No, Burb. Wow. Alright. Uh, well, I'm sorry, but we're gonna have to slow to you. Great. Oh, critical hit. Alright. Well, yeah. One, one Pokemon catch per route. Also, you will have to nickname every single one of your Pokemon. And so, great. And you must also, uh, once your Pokemon faints, it is considered, you know, dead. So, that's kind of a dark graphic to it. Look at that, we're in Kevlar Town. Ke Kevlar Town? Caviar Town? Right? Something like that. Okay, basically. Nice. <gasps> what is this? Is that a flying Pikachu? O10. Nice. It's like a flying cat thing. Alright. Honestly, for a fan made game, it's really well done. It's the Pokemon, right? Yup. Welcome! How am I at Serbia? Alright, so. Let's start off with a few potions. Uh, let's go ahead and grab five. Perfect. And Pokeball, let's buy, I don't know, three. Great. Alright, let's, uh... No, no, no. We're, we're good. We're good. Thank you. Anything else I can help you with? Thank you. Thank you for everything. Alright, great. 
Yeah, I, I think it's... Welcome to Kevlar Town, the tiniest town in Tandor. It's like, oh yeah, look at us, we're, we're, we're tiny. Alright. Ooh, the Poke Pokemon Center. Welcome to the Pokemon Center, where Pokemon can be restored to full health. Not bad. Alright. Now, I wonder, I wonder where we go from here. This is probably a berry shop, but we could we could use the berries. Nice. There's two orange berries here. Orange berries are kind of useful. They restore 10 HP. So for the beginning of our park, our Pokemon journey, that's actually pretty helpful. All right. Now let's see here. Well, on to Route Two already. But I mean, we we kind of reached Kevlar Town, so let's let's just go inside of here and see what's all the what's the fuzz. Uh, buying flowers to forgive you, girlfriend stuff. Berry shop. Take a free sample of most delicious berries. A baku berry. All right. A guara berry. A kupu berry. Lots of new berries. An Akai Berry. Oh boy. No, I, I've never... I've never quite had the pleasure of, like, um... Memorizing quite well all the... All the things. Alright. Let's see. <laughs> Look at our little Pokemon on the bottom. That's great. Alright, well, I guess we can save here. Uh, yeah, sure. Uh, no, I think. And let's, you know, let, let, let's go ahead and look at the, oh, right, like that. Let's go ahead and look at a, at Simon, which I, I should need, need to find the name changer, because that's a girl. Oh, great. Alright, we need 37 experience points to get it up to level 4. It's an impish little boy, which means its defense is going down, I believe, special attack up. Now, Codabug, it's a hardy nature, so I don't, I don't think it has anything to do with that. Alright. Yeah, it's Charm. Wait, what type ex- oh, you're a bug type. I'm guessing you're gonna grow into a fairy type as well, because, maybe. Charm, tackle, and string shot. And, uh, Team Rocket's tackle, of course it does. Alright. Well, guys, I guess we're gonna wrap things up here in Kevlar Town. Hope you enjoyed the episode. Uh, leave a like, subscribe for more stuff, and uh, I'm gonna go ahead and train off screen, and uh, that way we don't die instantly at the first gym battle. That's great, isn't it? All right, well, see you on the next episode, everybody.